So with the move to the new place in full effect, uh, unfortunately I don't have access to lights, sliders, tripods, anything I need to make a fancy tech video. You're probably thinking, Mark, you're exaggerating. Everything looks calm and neat back there. Well, it's all lies. So, yeah. So with that being the case, what are my alternatives? We could sit here and we could have a thought-provoking conversation on politics, the economy, global warming. Or we could sit and read the shit that people say about me on the internet. Nobody had asked for this, but come on, who doesn't like hearing people talk smack at me? We're doing mean comments too. Okay, what do we have here? He's using a polymorphic engine to mutate the code. Whenever I try to gain access, it changes. You'll really look like this kid called Sholan round my area. Well, what a lucky guy. I'm picturing young, handsome, intelligent, somebody who's really got some stuff going for him. He's in jail now, though, because he's a I'm actually not joking. You remind me of a chipmunk I used to know. Chip, chipmunk spelt wrong. I'm just trying to figure out if this guy's purposely trying to quote a Gautier song. But based on the number of emojis that you've left after the comment, it seems like it's a genuine, heartbreaking story of a woodland creature that you've lost contact with. You look like a rabbit beaver. Okay, I'm sensing like a woodland creature theme here. Let's move on. I clicked only to say your thumbnail makes you look like a beaver. Okay, seriously, there can't be many more of these. God damn it. Ah, we finally have one that isn't about my looks uh, and it's talking shit on the subject matter, which was Shadow Cloud PC. This is so It's pretty much telling a streamer to do what you want in your game while paying the money and also how the fuck is it your PC when you're renting it? Your moustache is probably painted black cocaine. <laughs> uh, firstly, that's the first time anyone has referred to this sorry excuse for facial hair as a moustache, so thank you for the unintentional compliment. And secondly, is black cocaine a thing? You, you been holding out? Black cocaine's a thing? You got some? I don't know how much flack I'm willing to take from diarrhea man. <laughs> uh, this one just says, shut the fuck up. But if I'm not talking, we can't get to the end of this video and John Wilkins can't get back to making his high quality top notch tech review content. Mic review. This is the AT2020. It um, had um, its polar um, pattern um, is cardioid. And, its um, frequency um, response um, is 20 um, um, to 20. That basically wraps up the video, but um. I'm gonna just give my channel to this guy. There's no competing. The legends with a Z. <laughs> So it's not gonna lie, you just like Galaxy Buds better because you're salty, you can't afford an iPhone or AirPods. That, that combo's like pretty much the same price as Galaxy Buds and an S10. I'm, I'm confused by the comment. The economics here is confusing. I'm sure it has nothing to do with my taste in brands. Rich boy using daddy's money to buy YouTube ads, huh? What? Me? <laughs> I'm 28 years old and have the mental capacity to operate a Google ads account. I mean, like just about, but we're not gonna pull on that thread. And just to set the record straight, I only use daddy's money to buy AirPods and iPhones, cause I can't afford them. Uh, Shrecky Hulk, this is the most disturbing picture I've ever seen, but thank you for that. Every YouTuber, sponsored by Honey, and I'm not, uh, I think this was somebody's first time on the YouTubes, and they may have confused the pre-roll ad with something that I have control over or have any affiliation to. I mean, that kind of assumption just makes me so mad. Almost as mad as I was when I found out I could have been saving money with my purchase online using Honey. Honey, let's talk. Okay, we're, we're getting back to the looks comments now. Okay, that's fine. He looks like a low budget Mr. Beast. That's fine, I'll take that. Jimmy's a wonderful philanthropist and a great content creator. Then somebody's replied, Mr. Cheap. Okay, ouch, that hurts. Mr. Least. He looks like McLovin. Aha! You can't make me cry with this one. We had this last time. Damn, McLovin. You sure have changed. I've owned it now. Hi, my name's Mark, and you may recognize me from such movies as Superbad and Kick Ass. I am McLovin. Yo, Squints, you and Wendy Peppercorn still together? Because of the glasses, it, I look like the kid from The Sandlot. See, so you would think that would hurt my feelings, but what? Smalley Bells here doesn't anticipate is three weeks after his witty comment that the actor who played Squints would go on to star in a Logic and Eminem music video. Squints from the Sandlot. Fuck rap, bustle like an addict with a semi-automatic who'd have had it any ready for anybody to fuck with. So, pff, who's laughing now? I mean, still not me. It's just giving me a glimpse of what I'm gonna look like in 20 years time. 
You look like Littlefinger from Game of Thrones. He's a Baelish. It's a good reference. It's a good reference. I like it. I'll give you a little finger. Uh, and then last but not least, if there's one thing I've learned in making this video, in reading through these comments, is to never reference Trump again. Literally, even if it's the most blatant, dry, satirical, sarcastic comment I could have ever made. Being a tech YouTuber in the UK is hard, because we don't get things like the Galaxy Buds until at least a full month after they've been released in the US. Thanks a lot, Trump. <laughs> even if it's followed up with a laugh, which then emphasises that the comment that was just made was a joke. Let's see how the calm and rational people of the internet reacted to that. <laughs> Fuck you! Just cause you don't live in the US, you can't blame Trump for how long shipment takes. It's not like they're going to send them early, cause that would basically be early access. Driving with my hands off the wheel cuz I be ghost riding my whip cuz I like doing that shit hammy. Sorry cuz, that literally has nothing to do with Trump. I'm not the biggest fan of his trade policies either, but things were being released in the UK late long before he was in office. It's just ignorant that you would blame everything on an easy scapegoat. Why not actually find a reason as to why it takes forever and tackle it? Ah, it, it looked like somebody left a smart ass comment below. Plus, as you've clearly just pointed out, I'm just an ignorant YouTuber. It's not my place to try and tackle Trump's trade policies. Don't talk shit on Trump, you little English boy. <laughs> Seriously, do I have some kind of fucking Benjamin Button disease or something? For the love of God, I'm 28. You're just mad because you can't jump the wall anymore and get what you want. <laughs> Uh, I'm led to believe that the level of redneck here is so high that this sister seducer just assumes that anyone who isn't a red-blooded American is automatically a Mexican. I'm proud of being American. And that's all I've got for you this week. Uh, the internet is a wonderful place filled with beautiful people who really strengthen your self-confidence and self-esteem. Uh, I'm hoping to continue to put stuff out even with with all of this. But as I said in the previous video, uh, part of the move will include putting together a new office. Uh, most of the stuff I've actually ordered and there's bits and pieces that I should be able to get straight in and start setting it up. And I'll be documenting that process as well. So it'll be its own kind of mini series of setting up the tech office. But until then, if you could just bear with me for a little while on the uploads, uh, if you'd like to keep track of everything else that's going on, even though I've been bad at social media lately, uh, you can follow me on Twitter. I'll leave it right here. That's where I'm most active. If you enjoyed this video, uh, give it a thumbs up. I really hope it doesn't start a trend of people leaving mean comments just to make it into one of these. Don't do it. Uh, if you haven't already, remember to subscribe to the channel. And as always, I shall see you in the next one, whenever that is. Bye.